we're going to explain how to forward a WeChat voice message to WhatsApp. This can't be done directly. WeChat and WhatsApp don't have a built-in forwarding feature between each other. Need to use a workaround involving recording and then sending. One, first, play the WeChat voice message. Two, then use your phone's built-in voice recording app. Most smartphones have one pre-installed. Three, start recording as soon as the WeChat voice message begins. Make sure your recording device is close enough to clearly capture the audio. Four, once the WeChat message is finished, stop your recording. You now have a copy of the voice message saved as a separate audio file on your phone. Five, next, open WhatsApp. Six, find the chat where you want to send the voice message. Seven, look for the audio or voice note attachment option within the chat window. It usually looks like a microphone icon or a paperclip icon. The exact icon might vary slightly depending on your WhatsApp version and phone. Eight, tap on this icon. Nine, you should see a list of files on your phone. Locate the audio file you just recorded. It might be saved in your phone's recordings, audio, or downloads folder. 10, select the audio file. 11, WhatsApp will now upload and send the audio file as a voice note. The recipient will receive it as a standard WhatsApp voice note, just like any other voice message you send. Remember that the audio quality might be slightly lower than the original WeChat voice message because of the recording and resending process. If you have trouble finding your recording, check your phone's settings and storage locations. It's possible the recording app is storing files in an unexpected location. Also, if the WeChat voice message is very long, it might take some time to record and send on WhatsApp. You might need to split a very long message into several shorter recordings. That's it. You've successfully forwarded a WeChat voice message to WhatsApp. This method works on both Android and iOS devices. Remember to adjust the steps based on your specific phone's operating system and app versions.